Hi, it's Gene, retired in Mexico, and if you're new to the channel, we ask one question here, which is, do they write them and sing them like they used to? A lot of people, young and old, they think the old music is better, but I'm not so sure, and today we're going to try to establish that with FKA, FKA Twix. So we haven't hit her up in a long time, but she's got a new single out. Not sure how to pronounce it. I guess I'll call it You Sexua, but I'm not sure. Uh, but you can see in the thumbnail how it's spelled. And if you like what I'm doing, you know, senior, older guy, reacting to the music of the 21st century. Not too many people doing that, right? And analyzing it. So uh, hit that like or subscribe button. I have a Patreon page too. You can support me there and all sorts of different ways that uh, you can help me out with likes and, you know, the whole bit. So anyway, let's jump into it. There's an official video, hoping it won't get blocked, of course, but she's never blocked me in the past. Of course, I did a tiny desktop concert. Should have checked what record label she records for. Ouch. Okay. Anyway, uh, I saw there were a couple other reactions. I'm not the first one, I guess. So it came out uh, Friday, Friday, last Friday. So I think it's been out for about six days so i'm a little late to the game but what can i say but let's go ahead and hit this up uh looking forward to it here we go now i have checked the lyrics in advance Strange. this doesn't go into an ad um i got a lot to say i got a lot to say so first of all is that there's so many different styles going through here so you could look at this two ways you could say hey it's a little add right it's all it's like here 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 like popcorn right but the transitions are are, are pretty smooth so it starts off with this, and I'm going to talk about the video too, because the video, this, you know, I, 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 I discuss music here, but how can you not talk about that video? Starts off glitch pop. That's what I heard. Very glitchy, 
in fact, a little too glitchy, perhaps for me, just, ugh. yeah, but then they went into an electronica phase. And so I was thinking, okay, that glitch pops kind of OOs a little, or tens, I mean, the uh, 2010s. And, 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 you know, I always think of bands like Fortet and that kind of thing. And then, um, it went into an electronica phase, which was nice, but I really loved about two thirds the way through the song reminded me of techno nineties techno, which I love. And that's when I was really bopping, really enjoying that. And then at the end, she was using auto tune there, which is very modern. I know, I know auto tune has been around for a while, but it's being pretty heavily used these days. Uh, so very, both 2024 and reaching back as far back as I would say the late nineties. So I heard styles stretching over a quarter century, you know, and it's, and this is one of the things I guess I could talk about real quickly. If you let me digress for just a second, uh, you know, a lot of people, you know, like I'll say I do, you know, meet somebody, oh, I, I do new music on, on my channel. It's like, uh, what are you talking about, Nirvana? And I'm like, no, Kurt Cobain's been dead for 30 years. Um, that's not new music, right? That's early 90s. Grunge is already two generations past. So uh, I think this was very modern, very retro at the same time within a framework of, say, 25 years. So that's pretty cool. Um but I think I responded more to the video because the choreography was extraordinary. The use of color was extraordinary. The use of flush tones against a black background there when it switched from the office out to the field and then all the bodies were mushed together. That, that was extraordinary. That was 10 out of 10. That, that section and... And you know what it reminded me of visually a little bit? It's been a long time since we did Arca, but it reminds me, I see kind of a visual influence of Arca. And then it was a long epic too. So that reminded me of when we did Frank Ocean's Pyramids, which is a long song that goes through a lot of changes. So, uh, but, you know, Frank Ocean does some rapping. She didn't rap that much. Um, but yeah, I, I, you know, it's definitely in terms of Arca, it was a little bit get your freak on, right? But not as extreme as Arca. Arca's way out there, right? But she's kind of moving into that territory a little bit. When they were out in the field, I, I got little hints of Bjork. Uh, I did a video last year where she was out in the field, and it was rather... Uh, that, that, that though was more mythologic, mythological and mystical. And this here was earthy, right? Had all the bodies, especially the male bodies up against hers. So yeah, very, um, it, you know, celebrating the human form. Um, I can tell this is a grower. I don't know how I'm going to rate it. Because I had, to, if I hadn't have read the lyrics, I, I wouldn't have understood what she was singing about. The re, the vocal production, and this is just my brain, okay? It's not right or wrong, but there's so much reverb on that vocal, that vocal production, that, I, you know, it's, it's too much reverb for me. There's no enunciation in the words, and I, I can't tell what she's singing, but... If you listen to a song over and over again, read a lyric sheet, you know, after a while you'll hear the words. So this requires repeated listenings. So I don't really know how to rate it. Um, the video, in terms of videography, um, A plus or S tier, I mean, visually it was stunning. Just stunning. We'll say we'll say A plus. Um, I think my favorite video of all time I did visually was Sophie. We did a thing with Sophie face shopping. So if that's the bar, this is right under that. Um, you know, we recently did a, a reaction to Jungle, and there was a lot of dancing in that. So 
you know, I could pick up, you know, some slight similarities, similarities there. So a lot going on, right? Yeah, uh, jungle, Frank Ocean, Arca, Techno, all these different things. I have got a cat jumping up in the kitchen. Wow. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to have to take care of him. Um, he's a brat. That's Leo. Uh, they're both brats in their own way, but he's the um, furniture leaper. Anyway, they've doubled in size. They're four months now. They're twice as big as when they were two months. But I digress. Uh, what am I going to give this? Musically, B plus A minus range on first listen. Okay, on first listen. That little techno section, A plus. Love that part. Just love that little bit two-thirds the way through. Um, yeah, I think it's a grower. I think it'll grow on me. Uh, but let's say... Let's say B plus for now for first listen, uh, because uh, mainly because of the vocal production. I think that's the main, um, the main thing that's causing a little bit of difficulty for me. But nothing in the uh, musical style. So that's it. Uh, let me know what you think. And as we say here in Bonita, Mexico, buen dia.